Hi, I'm Laurie, and welcome to your glute and leg compound workout. What you're going to need today is a mat. You will also need a chair, sturdy chair or a bench. Now, if you're using a chair for the hip thrust, make sure this back of the chair is up against the wall so it doesn't slide back on you. You're also going to need a book. We have a front foot elevated reverse lunges, but if you don't have a book, don't worry about it. Just do it on the ground without the elevation. You're also going to need dumbbells. For reference, I have one heavier dumbbell. This one, 25. I have a pair of 20 pound dumbbells, 20 each, and then a pair of 15s, 15 each. Today's workout will only be consisting of compound exercises. So that means we're gonna be hitting multiple muscle groups with every single exercise, lower body. Everything will also be in tri-sets today. So we have three exercises at a time. Each exercise will be performed for one minute each. After that third exercise, we will get a 30 second break before going into the next tricep. Be sure to look for the tempo. I have some pulses, I have slow eccentrics in there. So just be sure to follow that. We don't have to go at the same tempo though. You and I are different. So find a pace that is challenging for you. I want you to make that mind muscle connection and keep good quality form throughout. I will also tell you what weight selection I am using, but again, we're different, so find a weight selection that is challenging for you. Our first triceps going to be our warm up. It is body weight only, but if you're feeling good, you can grab a light dumbbell, uh, grab something for hydration as well, and let's get to work. Since we are going one exercise into the next, into the next for three minutes, be sure to look up in this upper hand corner for the upcoming exercise. Once you hear that ding, we've switched. All right, so we're gonna begin body weight only warm up, but if you want, grab a light dumbbell to make it a little bit more challenging if you feel like it. All right, I'm doing body weight only. First up, crossic squats. We're just aiming for really good mobility here, really good range of motion. This begins our warm up. Then three, two, and one, let's go. Doesn't even matter how hard I try Cause when I hear your voice my walls come down Boy you are the only thing I want There must be a way Next up, we have a pulsing squat. We pulse for three at the bottom before driving up. Let's go. Final exercise of this warm up will be an alternating reverse lunge. Really drive through the front heel, limit the back foot, drive off uh, as little as possible. So drive it through the front heel.
two, and one. All right, our first tricep is going to be a hip hinge movement. We have V-stands RDLs. We'll start with the left, 80% of the left foot, 20 of the right. Take it to a full hip flexion, hip extension. Dumbbell stay tight to the body. I'm gonna use my 20s. Think about driving your glutes back. Just don't take the dumbbells down. So push the hips back, back, back. Then drive it up. Take it to the other side in three, two, and one, switch sides. Coming up next, we have bilateral RDLs, equal weight in both feet, normal tempo, let's go. Last three, two, and one. Nice work. All right, put those dumbbells down. I will be using these dumbbells for the next tricep as well. If you have your book, grab it. We have front foot elevated reverse lunges with the pulse. I'm gonna start with my left foot, left hand on the chair, right hand has the dumbbell. So we step back, pulse, and then bring it up. We go in three, two, and one. Switch sides in three, two, 
and one, switch sides. In 10 seconds, we'll grab that other dumbbell. We have alternating reverse lunges, both feet on the mat, and let's go. Grab other dumbbell, let's hit it. We recover in three, two, and one. Hip thrust, tricep next. I'm gonna grab one heavy weight, 25. Go heavier, go lighter. B stance, B stance, bilateral. We'll start with the left. Left foot fully grounded, right foot turns into a kickstand. Slow tempo. Let's go. Drive it up, one count hold. Then we go down for three, two, one. Switch sides in three, two, and one. Other side. To you, to get to you, ain't gonna waste my time. I know that we ain't got connection. I think about you. You're on my mind, on my mind, on my mind. Yeah, I'm going out of my mind, out of my mind, out of my mind. Yeah, for you, my love. Tell me what to do, what to do I'm on my knees, yeah, I am begging you, begging you I'll break the rules if it will give me two, give me two, yeah In 10 seconds, we go bilateral normal tempo, but we'll take it one to a quarter rep. We go in three, two, and one. Equal weight in both feet, all the way down, all the way up, quarter of the way down, all the way up, again. Time. I know that we ain't got connection. I think about you. 
Last three, two, and one. Wow, okay. Coming up next, we have a static lunge slow. On the left, then on the right, and then we'll drop one of those dumbbells and do a one dumbbell only for the forward lunges. I'm grabbing my 15s, I've sweat in my eye. It's not very, it's not comfortable. Cause I can't get you out of my mind. I can't live without your love for sure. Static lunge, left foot forward, right foot back. Slow tempo. Three, two, one. Drive it up. Drive through the front heel. We take it to the other side in three, two, and one. In 10 seconds, we set one of the dumbbells down and we have alternating forward lunges with a twist. Take it very, very, very slow. One dumbbell goes down, dumbbell to the chest, forward lunge, right foot forward, twist towards the front leg. Last three, two, and one. Wow, grab a drink. Next up, we have a straight leg deadlift. So straight leg deadlift, we're just keeping the knees locked out. This will bias the hamstrings a little bit more. Still working the glutes, working the calves, back, posterior chain of the legs, but now we're gonna lock it out. Don't exceed your range of motion though. So you should feel a bigger stretch in the hamstrings with these straight legs.
Next up, we have squats. We'll just hang on to these dumbbells in a low position. Three, two, and one. Feet a little wider than shoulder width. Slight turnout. Take it down, three, two, one. One count, drive it up. In 10 seconds, we combine the two movements, one into the next. If needed, drop one of the dumbbells. We go in three, two, and one. Straight leg deadlift, take it back, bring it forward, then we squat. And one, nice. Okay, now we have a lateral lunge on the left, followed by the right, and then we'll go sumo squat. I'm gonna use my light dumbbells for the lateral lunge, and then I'll use my heavy, one heavy for the sumo. Lateral lunge. Let's go. I have a dream. That's all I need. I'll make it happen with some work and belief. Know what I want. So I'll take it on. I've made mistakes, but mistakes make you strong. Let's break it down for a minute. I want the crown, I'm gonna get it. You hear me loud, man, I'm winning. Yeah, Charlie Sheen will be grinning. These ladies know that I'm sitting, and this is just the beginning. I'm closing in the night, and there ain't no point in resisting. Living life like a dream, baby, right, that's the thing. Every night, got a team, I've been tied to the scene. Out on stage, here I'm screaming. Okay, it's a dream, and I pray as a team. One day, it be me. If I want it, then I get it. Hey, Dad, don't regret it. Push myself to the limit. If I play it, then I win it. I'm just saying, I'm just living for today, for a minute. I don't stay. I just visit. Have no shame. I admit it. Looking high, yeah. 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 Looking high, yeah.
Thinking big, never small Cause you gotta want it all When you finally get that call You get ready, take it on Need a handout I already stand out Starting to advance now Ready to expand now You don't have a chance now Cause we're in demand now Make it by the grand now Feeling in command now They're looking right at me To see if I succeed To see if I probably in 10 seconds, we're going to hold it low, pulse it with the heels up, body weight only, and three, two, and one. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, and one. Wow, shake it out. Next up, we have a bridge combo. Five exercises, all right? One into the next, into the next. Final round. I'm gonna use my 25 pound dumbbell. We are on our mat. We start with a B stance, left leg, or excuse me, left foot grounds, right foot into a kickstand. Three, two, and one, let's go. We switch sides in three, two, and one, other side. Next up, bilateral bridges, normal tempo, and three, two, and one.
Next up, we perform the top range of motion only, and we have a long pause at the top. We go in three, two, and one. So hold it here for two seconds, quarter the way down, drive it up, hold for one, two, down, up and hold. We hold in three, two, and one, hold at the top. We have 30 more seconds, hold. If you need to come out of it, rest for a second and then get right back into it. I know it is burning, just hold. Final 10 seconds, squeeze those glutes, get them up. Here's our last three, two, one and release wow Ooh, nice work place that dumbbell off to the side hug the knees in towards the chest and start to make big circles with the knees I'm massaging the low back as well all right let's take it to the other side nice work today <laughs> okay that was a glute little burner at the end and let's bring the right foot down, cross left ankle over, come into a figure four stretch. Really opening up that left hip. And let's bring it down, switch to the other side. One more big deep inhale as you exhale release grab a hold of the backs of the hamstrings give yourself a few rolls up should feel pretty good on the next roll come all the way up cross at the ankles hinge forward tabletop position let's get a few cat cows in big deep inhale belly down gaze up exhale around the spine once more come to a neutral tabletop position walk the hands in Bring the right foot out in front of you. Square out the hips, neutral low back, big deep inhale. Exhale, bring it forward. Targeting this left hip flexor down into the quad. To take it one step farther, reach left hand up and over. On the next inhale, come out of it, straighten the right leg, dorsiflex at the ankle. Start to hinge and now feel the stretch along the back of the right hamstring and into the right calf as well. The calf was used uh, as a secondary muscle group a lot today. On the next inhale, let's come up and switch sides. Left foot goes forward, neutral low back, start to come into it. That feels good, you can stay there. If you'd like to take it one step farther, reach the right hand up and over.
On the next inhale, come up to center, start to straighten the left leg, dorsiflex at the left ankle, send the hips back, 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 and enjoy this stretch. On the next inhale, come out of it, start to hinge from the left knee again, place the hands to the inside of the left foot, curl the right toe under, lift right knee off, and just step it back into a downward facing dog. Pedal out the heels left and right. Both heels reach towards the mat as you drive the chest towards the quads. On the next inhale, look up at the hands, tippy toe forward, grab opposite elbow, opposite hand for a ragdoll pose, yes is a nose with the head. Widen your stance here, heels and toes out. Bring all swaying to a stop. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, full forward fold. Bring it back to that flat back, and now start to hinge from the knees, and give yourself a nice gentle opening with the inner thigh. So gently press against the inner thigh, look over right shoulder, And when you're ready, take it to the other side. Come center, inhale up, final stretch. Let's hit those quads just a little bit more. So use your chair or wall to balance on the left foot. If you can, pull the right foot in and just work on driving the heel in towards the glute. And if you can't do it like this, you could uh, do it on the mat. Just place your feet in this position and slowly lean back. And let's take it to the other side. And release y'all. Let's take a big round of breath together. It's my favorite way to end. Inhale up and exhale open. Y'all, you rock, great job. Let me know how you like this in the comments below. Be sure to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Follow me on IG at Laurie Midkiff and have a wonderful rest of the day. You rock.